Hey there, everyone. Welcome back to the channel. It is Friday, technically Thursday for me. Still technically Thursday, though it is very late. It is almost Friday. I, you don't care about that. Listen, before I get into today's video, I'm gonna let you know we're doing a special live stream later today. So if you could stop on by, okay? There should be, I don't know when you're seeing this, but uh, if it's still Friday, the 29th of April, 2022, when you're watching this, uh, stop by. Uh, there should be some sort of placeholder up on the channel. If you're subscribed, you get notified, I hope. That's how YouTube works. Or I'm in a feed somewhere. I don't know. I'll ping on Discord too if you're in there. Just stop by if you get a chance. Uh, we're gonna do uh, something a little fun. It's been it's been a dark week, just in general uh, for me, and I want to put some good back in the world. So that's what we're gonna do tomorrow, right? Or today. We're doing that today. Friday. It's happening Friday. Anyway, um, Mythic Duma banner. Yay. <laughs> reason you're all here probably um this is this is a good banner and we're gonna summon on it by god uh i have picked out one candidate from each color uh, i'm genuinely like color is pretty good in general uh if i gotta go red i'm hoping it's all tina if i gotta go blue i'm hoping it's eden um so yeah that's that's the the battle plan for today uh also thank you to members members you are the orbs of my life. That's how I feel about you. Is that parasocial? That feels parasocial. Anyway, thank you, members. <laughs> thank you, members. I appreciate you, members. Um, let's let's hippy hop on in. Oh, wait, it's not spring anymore. Let's let's dive on in. It's almost summer, right? It's close enough. Uh, we can also spark at some point. I don't know when that's gonna be. Blech. But you know. If we go the spark, we go the spark. Uh, it, it, it is what it is. Do we want, I mean, do we dare? Do we dare to? I really, I'm really just about the Duma. You know, I'm not necessarily in it for Duma merges. Oh, why do I call him Duma? Medeus. Medeus, have I been calling him Duma this entire time? Oh, God. You know, I just, I see... The eyes and technically Duma is an Earth Dragon. Same tribe. I mean, you know, I'm not like wrong, wrong. I mean, I am wrong, but I'm not like wrong, wrong, wrong. Right? Copium? Am I just, <laughs> just trying to justify it to myself? Uh, uh, uh yeah. Medeus. Have I been calling it Duma the entire time? Oh God, that's embarrassing. Medeus. It is, in fact, Medeus. You, look, it's not Remix yet, okay? Which, speaking of, yesterday, yes, yesterday, or, you know, if it's after Friday, whatever day you're watching this, uh, the Hero Tracker went out. So if you haven't seen that yet, you should. There's some good good in there for you, let me tell ya, gamers. Let me tell you a little something, gamers. There's some good good in there. Uh, lots of colors. That's hype. A lot of good stuff. The benefit is that we can spark, and so we can just get a Duma. He <laughs> I did it again. Ah, Medeus. God, I'm catching myself now. We can get a Medeus. <laughs> we can get Medeus through Spark. I just, I bet I called him Duma the entire video so far. How deep are we? Four minutes. Great. I <laughs> love that. That's great. Love that. That's awesome. Uh, anyway, that's fun. That's fun. Maybe I'll put a little uh, Duma counter in the very bottom. Every time I say Duma, I'll add something to the counter. <laughs> oh, God. All right. I hate everything. It's been a week, guys. It's been a week. She's been a week, gamers. It's It's been rough, man. <laughs> It's been rough. The house closing thing is, is undergoing. Uh, we're currently awaiting to hear back on appraisal to see if our bid was actually, like, smart or not. Did we overpay? Did we underpay? I don't know, man. <laughs> I don't know what's going to happen. But I'm hoping it's it's good news in general. Eh, you know, work's been stressful. There's, been, there's a lot of negativity. 
there's just a lot of negativity this week, guys. Uh, and I, I don't know. Maybe you're feeling that way, too. Uh, if you are, I hope things start looking up. Uh, in fact, I know that they will start looking up. Because, you know, things take a turn the minute you least expect it. And uh, that is that is right where you want to be, in my opinion. You want to be right on the cusp of things getting better. Because it's, uh, it's quite a, a faith restorer, is what I like to refer to it as. Uh, when things get tough, you know, you have this this moment that comes back around and you're like, oh, the world is not awful. <laughs> and yeah, you know, so that's, uh, that's, that's where I'm at. I'm waiting for the upturn and uh, hoping that it's sooner than later. Um, but, you know, if, if you're having a rough go this week, today, this month, whatever. Hey, May's almost here, gamers. May's almost here, okay? We got tons to look forward to. Except a new Genshin patch. That evidently is getting delayed, which is not surprising uh, due to the restrictions uh, happening in, in China. I think it's specifically Shanghai where it's going on. Um, hopefully that was enough to inform you without getting the video suppressed or flagged or anything like that. Um, I don't want to spread misinformation if I'm wrong, but I, I'm, pr I'm pretty sure there's there's some stuff happening over there at the moment that's uh, keeping people from doing anything. Really, they're they're pretty much shut in at, at home. Uh, so you know, the I think uh, what the what did, what did the team actually call it? Uh, something about project progress or something. I think is what they they called it. Which is really like we just we can't work, like we literally can't work. So completely understandable, obviously, um, and terrifying, honestly. Like there's there's a lot of uncertainty when when that happens. Oh, oh, my girl, you're not Medeus, but I will take you. I'll never be sad to see a legendary Micaiah. Let's go. What are you? Plus speed. <laughs> well, might as well start on the next one. You know what they say, when you've made one, you might as well make another. Yeah, I don't... Does she even have the fodder? Wish she have, like, Joint Distant Guard or something? Fury 4 and Joint Distant Guard, yeah. Not worth. Too beautiful to destroy, am I right? Of course I am. I'm absolutely right. Might as well go for another plus 10 right now while we're at it. No downside. Just kidding. I'm trying to buy a house. Okay. <laughs> I don't have that budget right now. And I, I, you know, I'm waiting for like, I'm waiting for, uh, for, for, for bride Pala. Cause that's going to be a thing. A lot of people are joshing me telling me, Oh, Brian, <laughs> Paul and Rhea. <laughs> Look, she's going to be free. Okay. Don't even at me. Do not, do not at me on Twitter. I will ratio you so hard. Okay. Uh, look, it's not copium to think that Ray could just be a semi-bad GHB. Like, that's possible. Okay? We're getting a really good colorless infantry dragon right now. You really think we're going to give us another really good dragon? No. That's not going to happen. You are you are copium for thinking that, frankly. Okay? So, there. There. I said it. I'm not taking it back. Your copium, and it's cringe. Um, can't take myself serious sometimes. Uh, so yeah, I, I there, there, anyway, there's a lot coming down the pike, right? And uh, we're gonna we're gonna be moving soon and paying off taxes. First half of my year is very expensive. <laughs> Evidently, the first half of my year is very expensive. So, um, but it will be kind of cool, uh, pending. <laughs> Everything goes through with the house okay. The inspection came back. Everything looks great. Um, I'm, I'm hoping the appraisal also goes very well. And that we don't have to go in and, like, negotiate stuff. I, I paid what I think is a little under what the house will appraise as. Uh, which is a rare thing to do in this market, if you're unaware. 
If you didn't know, the housing market is insane. Uh, and people are paying like $100,000 over asking price. And the asking price is already like way more than what the appraisal value would normally be in a standard market. And it's just like, whoa, that's crazy. Uh, <laughs> so we had, we had kind of like a, a serendipitous moment, if you will, uh, where everything just kind of fell into place. Um, I don't know if I ever really talked about it in a video yet. Um, but the, the TLDR, the too long didn't read of it all, is that we had two houses uh, to look at one night. And uh, this the house that we ended up putting an offer in and, and winning um, uh, came available like four hours prior to that. We showed it to our agent. He said, what are you doing? Uh, in like two hours, we're like, nothing, gamer. What's up? He's like, you want to go see it? And we're like, bet. So we did. And we, <laughs> we went to go see it. And I was like, this is the ugliest house I've ever been in. Let's buy it. And uh, so we put a we put a timed offer in. Normally it would be called a, a bully offer, uh, where you give them a very you give the seller a very short amount of time to respond. Um, but it wasn't really to pressure the seller. It was mostly to beat out an open house that was looming in two days. Because <laughs> if you can if you can buy the house before there's an open house, you have a much better chance of winning said house. Uh, and so that, that was our strategy. We were, we were bullying other prospective buyers, basically. Uh, not so much the seller. And so, um, but we, I, we, like I said, we put in a fair, very fair offer. Um, and I, I felt good with it. And they did too, obviously, because they accepted it, like, pretty quickly. Um, within, like, four hours, actually. So... So, uh, it, you know, it, everything everything kind of fell into place, and you know, it, it had it had everything that we wanted, just in a in a in a thirty year old unexpected package <laughs> that we didn't really anticipate. Um, but you know what? It's gonna be fun redoing it, and if you buy a house and then you know live stream the renovation of it all, then that is content and therefore tax deductible. Yes, I think that's how that works. So uh, I bought content basically, which is great for me. And my accountant will figure it out next year. Thumbs up. <laughs> Definitely not doing our taxes next year. I've been doing our taxes for as long as Jen and I have been together. I did my taxes before Jen and I were together, actually. Like it was, oh, we got an Eden. Let's go. Let's go. I'm honestly only pulling on three colors just because I want to get to spark faster. <laughs> Cause like I'm good with one Medeus. I'm not gonna fire him. Crazy people out here firing for cancer control. Like what? Um, anywho, point being, I've been doing our, our taxes for like ten years now. Ah, I'm done. <laughs> I don't want to have to figure out like, oh god, what? Rai, why are you here? Uh, I don't want to have to figure out like the house tax stuff and like I just I want I want someone else tax taxish smarter than I am to figure that out for me um, and I'm happy to be because like I I use I use a certain software for uh, self-employed slash business owners uh, a, a certain package that they sell I won't name them because uh, I don't believe in publicity of, of this particular company. Uh, but this company basically lobbies our government to make uh, like free tax software illegal. Uh, <laughs> where there was something happening with uh, the federal government where they were going to release their own tax software that basically said, like, we know about how much you owe. This is it. Uh, provide your W-2s and stuff and blah, blah, blah. And uh, if you think it's right, great, pay it. If you don't, uh, you know, we'll, we'll figure it out. Um, and it, it would have been a very simple process. But there's <laughs> there's uh, one or maybe even two companies, actually, uh, that are out here basically lobbying to make taxes more complicated than they need to be. <laughs> because it makes them a lot of money. Uh, and they even go so far as to, like wipe the SEO of their free product so that you literally cannot search for it. Um, and they hide it very well. It, it's it's some shady nonsense. I, we're not pulling blue anymore, by the way. 
we're Dunsies on blue. Uh, we're just going colorless and red now that we're we're in the home stretch. Okay, this is this is the end game now. Like we're getting down there, so yeah, I'm, I'm comfortable just kind of lopping it off here. Um, anyway, yeah, taxes should and can be easier, but you know, money is at play, so it's not. <laughs> it's just fun. It's so fun. It's so fun to be an adult. Let me tell you. Uh, but yeah, that's that's not me next year. Nope, because I I think I pay to use the software that helps me file on my own about as much as it would be if I paid someone to file it for me. And like, if I'm stuck, then I'm stuck. <laughs> you know what I mean? But like I do, I do technically have an LLC. And so uh, I'm not, uh, I, I, I want to, I want to, I want to use the proper software, right? That, that helps guide me. Cause you know, I, if you miss stuff and you mess it up, then like it jails and fines and that's your future. And I'm like, I'm not about that. It's my house. I'm not going to jail. I don't want to go to jail. I just want to pay the government what they think I should pay them and call it good. Uh, just let me, let me live in the house. I just tried to buy. So please, that's all I ask. Anyway, um, that was a long tangent to basically tell you that taxes are dumb. It's really, really dumb. Uh, and we haven't gotten anything good here, man. We're still just kind of, still just kind of out here vibing. But we are getting reds and colorless, which is kind of nice, I guess. Still some good good here. Uh, I, ooh, ooh. So we're running the gauntlet, eh? <laughs> We're running the gauntlet, eh? That's what we're doing, huh? Okay. All right. <laughs> I will spark for a Medeus. Not Duma. Medeus. I will spark for a Medeus. I am fine with that. Uh, and I think we're going to maintain 8% now that we're resetting anyway. Uh, before spark. So literally no reason to go back in on this banner overall the banner outside of colorless not really super fantastic awesome happy fun time you know what i mean like it's cool nice uh this gives us just enough actually which is very cool i think no ah oh, shoot we're one shy we're one short shucks I needed four to pull, didn't I? Yeah. Because now this one's going to be 38. That's going to be 39. Shoot! All right. Well, we're going to have to go back in again. I guess it's worth one extra orb to pull from a possible colorless slash red. Whatever. Getting another Altina would be neat. I have, a, I have a theory. If you didn't see the hero tracker, you should. Uh, but Altina is basically not coming back till January. So I have a theory that Altina is going to be remixed upon her next return uh, in January of 2023. So um, high hopes, high expectations. I'm hoping Altina is absolutely bonkers. Um, I hope Naga is actually more bonkers. Hey, look at that. Perfecto. Look at this go here. Look at this do our thing. Medias. That is not Medea's. Nope. Nope. I dare say that's the exact opposite of Medea's. Yeah. Basically the exact opposite. All right. So here's the dealio. Uh, we didn't get an Altina. Uh, that's fine. The off shot of not getting Altina. Not super great. Uh, but we did get one of every colorless. And we got arguably, for at least my account, uh, the best blue option that there could be. Because, uh, you know, I already have like 15 Dimitri. So, we need more of him. Uh, uh, but hey, Medeus, come on home. My Dragon King. My Dragon King. 
You can hip on, hop, hang out with the ladies. Let's go. Medeus. Open it up. What a god. What a god gamer. Um, he's actually so stupid. <laughs> like, he's actually so dumb. I'm really hopeful uh, that what, what they're doing for him, obviously not in the same way, but somehow helps translate to Naga's remix um, because Naga has been a long-term merge project of mine and we're getting closer and we'll, we, we may very well be able to plus 10 her on her remix uh, whenever, whenever that happens because I think she's at like plus eight, which means if we can just nab one and then spark, uh, we're good to go. Uh, but Medea is definitely, definitely, definitely insane. Um, I think probably plus attack minus speed is uh, optimal for him. Um, but you know, neutral, neutral's great. Neutral's great. No banes, no banes, no worries. That's what I say. Anyway, uh, four in 40, that's one every 10. That's not bad. Technically one every like 11 or something. Uh, math, am I right? <laughs> Who's got the time? Anyway, uh, thank you again to members. Members, the lifeblood of the channel. Thank you very much. I appreciate you. Um, I, uh, I, 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 I thank you members. And by the way, there, there will be a member review on Saturday. Uh, which is the day after today. So if you have anything you want to submit, check out the member tab. Uh, it's somewhere on YouTube. I can't see it because I'm not a member. Fatal flaw in YouTube's membership program. The creator cannot see the member tab. YouTube. Please. <laughs> nah. Anyway, uh, what else? Oh, live stream again today. Stop by if you can. Uh, it'll be a good time for, for good things. Uh, that is it. Let me know how your summons went in the comments. Uh, again, if you haven't checked out the Hero Tracker that went live yesterday, go give that a watchy woo. Um, but that is it for right now. Thank you again so much for watching. Be sure to subscribe and come back for more. And until then, I will catch you next time.